What is going on everybody and welcome back. We are here on my main account and we're gonna do summons for the spear bomb Goku from the Trolls movie. Arguably the best unit in the game. Arguably. Super arguably. Um, but this banner is unique for two reasons for me. Oh, two reasons and then one extra reason. One, it is the introduction of Pity System. JP got this as well with LR Ribrian. So how it works is that you summon and you just get these coins. After the banner goes away, if you have any of these specific coins from this spe from that specific banner, they immediately get converted into yellow coin at the exact same amount. So if you had 200, or if you had 300 of them lying around for whatever reason, um, at the when the banner goes away, those 300 limited coins, these these gray ones. We'll get or silver or whatever will get converted over to the to just the generic gold ones right and at the same time you can just straight up exchange them in the same moment so you don't have to wait for the banners to go away so there's that so it's very good um the second thing is that for yellow coins or i guess let's just say yellow coin banners legendary summon banners there is the guaranteed feature uh multi summon so as you can see here, after two multis, we get a, on our third multi, we get a chance to get Goku at a guaranteed featured rate. Um, this will have various degrees of whether or not it's worth it, so on and so forth. You know what I mean? But this encourages players to not only summon for Goku, but maybe continuously summon for Goku, depending on how the banner looks. Now, if the banners get better or if they put more better cards on the banner and yada yada, right? Um, there could be some good stuff, but it is, it is what it is. And you're able to buy Goku. I should have probably talked about this with the Greystone when, when I talked about the Greystone, but with 200 of these, which is about, a, which is a thousand stones, you will be able to buy the brand new card after spending a thousand stones on the banner. Now I have a thousand stones. I am not going to use a thousand stones, but I want to do a couple of multis. Uh, and this leads to my second reason of, uh, I guess my third reason um, my third reason is that I don't have AGL Golden Frieza. Out of all the LRs, I still do not have him or Great A Vegeta. So I hope to pull Golden Frieza in this. I don't have enough yellow coins to buy him, unfortunately. Um, but in the process, if we can, hopefully we get Goku, right? But we're going to do, I don't know, we'll see. I'm not, I'm not going to go past 300, I know for a fact, but I kind of want to do a couple of these multis to see how my chances are and stuff like that. So, uh, the banner looks, it's fine. You know what I mean? Uh, it's whatever. Uh, Goku himself is arguably the best unit in the game. Uh, these guys are still, they're fun. They're not fantastic or amazing or crazy, fan, you know, insane, but I, I really like them a lot and I think they're really fun to use, right, for sure. Uh, Golden Freeze is still one of the best units in the game, considering his damage reduction. He's on a bunch of teams, right? Good villain teams, right? So he's definitely one of the staple units for sure. Whenever, wherever you could put him, he's just a flat out fantastic unit, right? Uh, Yajirobe's on the squad. Uh, Krillin and Gohan, whatever. Uh, Krillin, this Krillin, if he gets an easy A, I feel like he could be very, very good. But until that happens, uh, Super Saiyan Go Tanks at one time he was very good. Now he's like kind of a whatever unit. Uh, this team trunks needs an easy A. Uh, Hatchy is still pretty good now, but his team uh, and his requirements kind of a little bit lackluster for sure. Especially how the current meta is right now. It is it is what it is, right? But Hatchy is still a very powerful unit to pull. Um, this Goku, whatever, and then that's where it ends, right? So let's see what we get. Let's do some of these multis. Let's see what we get. Um, I'm gonna do at most 300. I'm not gonna go past that. Um, as, as crazy as this unit is, um, and fantastic and amazing he may be, I am not going to waste that many stones for, I have a lot of reasons why the big reason is because of heroes, right? I love the heroes units. They may not be crazy good, especially cause they're all a bunch of gimmick characters for sure with not very fantastic or great defensive attributes outside of like dodging and stealing and stunning you know guard and damage reduction are good but their stats aren't good right blah 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 reasons reasons right but they're awesome units and funny units to use i want the heroes because hopefully hey rose three goku black bro boy like i'm ready i'm ready that's what i want i don't want anything else but that right there what i just said 
Um, then there's full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku. There's the banners that are going to come out in December. The Dual Dokkan Fest is but just going to come out in December. Um, in the slot where Beast Gohan and Orange Piccolo were. Whether they're LRs, Dokkan Fest, uh, it's left to be seen. Uh, or TRs, sorry. And then there's the step up, which I don't think I'm going to be summoning. But there's just another reason why you shouldn't summon on Yellow Coin. Even with this pity system, it blows, dude. You get shit. Alright, so now this is our guaranteed featured SSR. So, hopefully it's Goku. Hopefully it's Golden Frieza. Those are the only two that I want. I already have Goku and, Goku and Gohan, dude, like a million times over. I don't fucking want them, but <sighs> let's see. I want, I mean, if I get Goku, I get Goku, right? It is what it is, but I really want Golden Frieza. Oh, did I forget that, um, hmm. That uh, the other feature units are also Krillin and fucking <laughs> everybody else, too. So it's not even an LR. So there you go. So uh, we'll do one final rotation. We'll do maybe one or I'll do I'll do three, four rotations. But we'll, we'll see. I don't know. I, I, I'm not keen on summoning this. Golden Freeze is amazing, dude. He is amazing. I love him, right? I love him on my main on my free to play account. I have him there. Which is very funny because I've never pulled him on this account. Just oh, we got Yajirobe. That's nice. Um, but I'm not I'm not too keen of continuously summoning for the arguably the best unit in the game being Goku, right? Uh, Spirit Bomb Goku from the Turles movie. Um, he is too good to have in my box, absolutely. But nonetheless, he is. Uh, if we get him, we get him. If we don't, we don't. I I really don't care. I'm only doing this because I don't know. I want to in a little way. Gives me a chance to possibly get Golden Frieza. But, oh, dude, we're getting really good SSRs. We got two featured units being uh, double Gotenks. And then we got TN, which is arguably better than fucking Gotenks. I'll take TN. And I'll, ta I'll take the Gotenks, sure. I think I already have him rainbow, so that's his SSR copy for sure. All right, this is the guaranteed featured. Um, and then after this, I'm done. We're just going to end it. It doesn't matter what we get. It is what it is. Um, but I, I wanted to summon a little bit to maybe get Goku, maybe get Golden Frieza to show off the new pity system, right? Um, but th this is going to be it, so. Oh, we got Yajirobe! Look at that! <laughs> oh, my God. Whatever. Ah, I, got, I, got, I got one more rotation in me. I got one more rotation in me. This is probably stupid, but I, I got one more rotation in me. Because why not? Why not? But the rule still applies once we do the... Oh, it's an LR. It's an LR. I don't know about feature LR, but it's an LR. <laughs> or we just get anything else. I, I fucking hate yellow coin banners. They sometimes treat me well, sometimes they don't. They also... I They didn't do tickets for whatever reason. Oh, wow. Okay. So, hmm. Out of all the yellow coins that I've yet to don't have, I think I have all of them, really. I do not have this Grady Vegeta. I don't have, I never, I've never pulled them. And I don't want to buy them. You know what I mean? Because he's kind of a whatever unit. But what I got Grady Vegeta. I'll take that. I will take that. I don't have him. So, 50 stones spent well because I don't have him. And he is... He could be good. He can be good. I don't, I don't know about anything beyond that, right? And it's very specific stages, very specific setups kind of a thing. And I would imagine... He's fun, right? Um, I don't know because I've never used them. All I, can, all I can give... My opinion comes off of videos, right? And where I see them and all that stuff. His animations are cool, right? His giant form's strong, right? Blah, blah, blah. But he himself, I don't know. I can't give an opinion because I don't have him on either one of my accounts until just now. So, you know. And this is a guarantee after this we're done. Hopefully we get Golden Frieza. Or the best unit in the game. Boma would be nice to get too, right? But <laughs> I already have her. 
Wow, Krillin and Gohan, the guaranteed feature. Yo, that's crazy. Wow, we got Goku. I, dude, we don't know who the guaranteed feature was. It could have been Goku. It could have been Go Gohan and fucking Krillin. Wow, so I could keep going. I'm not going to, but I could keep going. Uh, there's another aspect of this is that when you exchange characters in the Baba shop, you know, I'll, I'll pull, I'll get, I'll get these right here, right? Um, oh, look at that 90. That's crazy. Um, if we kept going and use a thousand, we could have, we could get Goku, but Goku's too good to be in our box. I promise you who he is, right? So, um, where is it? Oh, there it is. So we could do this and then for the limited time, we can exchange all characters over, right? That we've already pulled and rainbowed and stuff like that. And I'm very tempted to because that's 39. So technically speaking, if you have a full box of rainbow characters and you don't need a lot of this crap, it can only take you a lot less depending on how your luck is, right? So you could potentially get multiple copies of the brand new card depending on how many cards you pull that are already rainbowed. Now, this is a very good sense of luck and all that stuff, right? But this, this is really good. I am not going to do this because a lot of these characters I still need dupes of and and you know SA ranks and all that stuff right so I'm not going to do this um, but if I was close to that is an option for all of you for sure um, but that's pretty much it ain't much else to say um, I don't have enough well actually if I exchange some of them hold on hold on hold on, hold on. so I have 385 we could leave this video with Golden Frieza as I'm willing to buy Golden Frieza. I like his leader skill and he's fine, right? But I, I can also fuck with... Um... Hold on. Yeah, he's 500. I could totally get him. Because I'm not going to get the rest. So I could do this. How many do I have? Wow. Oh, dude, I could totally do that. Would this work? No, because it's, it's not a yellow coin. So, do I need any of these? Genuinely? Let me do this. I think it. No, I, I have to do this many. Okay. So, then if I go over here. This is, uh, you're watching me do this, right? Which is awesome. Now I have 500, I could buy Golden Frieza. We're buying Golden Frieza. Because I, I will show you, I don't have them. I want them. I need them. Boom, Golden Frieza acquired. GG. <laughs> All right, so acquired SSRs. Boom. So we pulled, dude, I have a lot of cards. I just need to clean up. I need to clean up a bunch of my box. So we pulled Great of Vegeta. One of the very few yellow coins that I do not have, which is good. And then we bought Golden Frieza, which if I had enough anyways without doing the exchange, I would have gotten him anyways. We didn't get the best unit in the game, but that is okay. We'll get him later. Um, he will be sorely missed. All that stuff. But nonetheless, with that being said, guys, do appreciate you guys watching until the end of the video. Do I recommend you summoning for this banner? Absolutely not. You should save your stones for shittier units, for sure. But just letting you know, the pitting system is now in place. Whether or not this gets extended over to Dokkan Fest and Carnival Banners, we'll see. We'll see how that all plays out. And then, obviously, uh, the next Yellow Coin Banner is whenever that comes out. Which I think is Omega Shenron, but who, who the hell knows when he's going to come out. He could be in January, February. I, I, don't, I genuinely don't know. Especially because they're doing like little bits and pieces of catching up the game. Catching up each other's, uh, and catching up both versions. I'm pretty sure the schedule is going to be kind of wonky and events are going to come a little bit sooner. I don't know. They're probably going to do bits and pieces here and there um, as as time goes on. But we'll see how this all plays out. But I'm out of here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think. And I'll catch you guys later. Good luck on your summons. If you do summon, you shouldn't. But good luck if you do. I'm out of here. Peace.